Hi guys. Thursday's Go Figure maths worksheet is um, about division, but all our division questions are divided by two, which is the same as halving. So I thought we might have a look at a few different strategies of how we could do that if we can't do it mentally. Obviously, I want you to try to do it mentally, but if not, we need to find a way that will make our job a little bit easier. So let's look at the first one, 64 divided by 2. When we need to divide it by 2, we're halving a number and we can halve it in chunks. So we know that 64 is 4 ones and 6 tenths. It's the same as 60 and 4. So we can halve both of those numbers. Half of 4 is 2, half of 60 is 30. 30 and 2 is 32, if I'm using the same way out the top. So 64 divided by 2 is 32. I would suggest finding the number 32 wherever it may appear and putting the capital T in nice and clearly. I might be missing some, but I don't need to find the answer to the puzzle. I just need to help you find the answer to the maths questions. Wow, lots of T's. Move on to the next one. Let's look at a bigger one that's a little bit harder to uh, divide by 2. Uh, let's look at 484. 484 is the same as 484. Let's divide all those numbers by 2 or half them. Half of 400 is 200. I know that because half of 4 is 2 and I just have to add the zeros to the end. Half of 80 is 40, and half of 4 is 2. That's the same as 242. 242, 242. Well, let's write that down there. And uh, now I now know that all the 242s needs to be the letter C. I'm not going to go through all of that. It is totally fine if you just look for the numbers that you find easier to halve. Do it as process by elimination. So you might find that majority of these you find easy to do. Do those that first and then you can leave those tricky ones to last. But you might see an answer that you think, ah, that might fit. So start with the easy ones. That might work for you. Good luck.